Alright, so this is how to make Luna the kitty from Sailor Moon. Here it is. We're going to start with the ears up top and then we're going to work our way down that way and then the whiskers will be last. The order of what we're stringing it on is this. So the pink, yellow, and red, I mean the pink, yellow, and pink that are on top of the black is the top of it. So how are you stringing it on? I'm using fishing line. I think that's better than... Um, regular stretching string, stretchy string, but whatever. But, um, so what you're gonna do is you're gonna fold your string in half where you have two ends, and it's like a loop. And you're stringing on your first two, one on each end. Just let it drop. It should look like that. And then for your next one, you put the two ends together and string on one bead. You can just do that with all of them. Alright, once you string them all on, it should look like this. What you're going to do is you're going to even out your two strings. And then you're gonna tie it. And you should tie it as tight as you can so it's once you have tied it, it should be like this. What you're gonna do is you can take one of your strings and you're going to string it through the bottom black bead. So you basically the bottom. So um these are the top. You're just gonna go through the black that's on the bottom. And you're going to string on a black, a white, a black, and a white, and then a black. Oh, and when you string it on, I forgot to mention this, is your string will be coming through a bead, and you're going to like basically skip this little one that's like down there and go through the one that's sticking up so it's like through here and here like that and sorry I forgot to mention that first and then it should look like this and then since and then what you're gonna do is you're gonna take the string you're just working with and basically string it all the way through until it's coming out of this bead so I'm just basically going through here and then through this one and there's going like that all the way across. string should be coming through this one that you were just working with. Now with your other one that you weren't working with, string it through the black on top. That. And then you're going to do, you're going to string on pink, and then a black, and then another black. A pink and then and I'm gonna black and then a pink. And then we'll do the next row. For your next row it's just the row of all black. For those years it's now just black. So what you're gonna do is your string is coming out of this bead. You're just gonna string on a black bead. And go through the pink bead that you just strung on, and then just do your row of black. When you 
gets the string on your your last black bead. You can't because all that. So you get a string on the string you've just been working with. And then with the other one, you're gonna take the other one that you weren't working with and string it through the black bead going the opposite direction that the uh, one you have been working with is going through. And just pull and it should end up going like this. And then what you're gonna do is you're going to string on a black bead to the next row. And then we're going to take the string and we're going to just make it to go through this black bead. So we're just gonna start to do this wall. This one, this one, this one, this one, that one, and till I reach this one. Once your string is through this black bead, you're just gonna string on a black bead like normal. Then you're just gonna string on a black bead and go through that bead that you just strung on. Now that side of the ear is done, we're gonna move on to the other. You're gonna take your other string that you haven't been working with that's on the other side, and you're just gonna string on a black bead like the other side. String it on and go through this one. And then that's the ears, and so you're just gonna tie it. How I tie it is what well, was on the end, but is I take the string and I go between beads, and there's that string in between, and you just put it in between like that, and then you have a loop. And then you have your string and you pull that string through the loop and you just pull. That's how I tie everything off. And then cut your extra string off. Oh, and I normally string it through a couple beads before. I tie it just so that everything gets tight and there's like no loose beads. So here's the ears. Um, and now you're gonna, you're gonna start on the body, the I mean the face, the head, yeah, whatever it is. Um, so you're gonna just take a piece of whatever you're using, using fishing, cut a piece of it, and you're going to string it through this black bead, right. and then you're going to even out the two ends, and that's how we're going to start the um, face. So. Alright, so once you even up the two strings, the string going towards the kitty is the one you're going to be using first. So you're going to string on um, a white bead, two blacks, and a white. Oh, and don't let this string coming out of this side um, fall out. Alright, so it should look like this. You're just going to string on a, a black and then go through the white you just strung on. So it should look like this so far. And now we're just going to string on brown, black, brown, black. Alright, just 
string on the black, you're going to string it on the string you've been working with. And with the one you haven't, you're going to string it through the black bead going the opposite way that the other string is going. Like that, and it should look like this, and you just pull. And it should end up like that. And this is how it should look so far. Um, yeah. And then the next row is... look like this now and your next row will be black brown black brown and black that one it looked like this um, the next row is a whole row of black Like this one. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. This is the next one. Mm -hmm. This now, like this, the full row of black. But right now, you're going to take your string of working with it and thread it. Through the one just strung on. So now coming out of this, coming out of this one now, and just string on with three beads. You should look like this, and now you're done with this part and tie it. and cut off the excess. And now we'll do the whiskers. It should look like this at the moment. Okay. Alright. For the whiskers, it's basically just two each each and still need four pieces of string and two for each whisker. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna take your string and we're gonna do the top whiskers up here. You're gonna string it your string through this right here and 
and then the other end of your string through this bead. Even at your string and string on through both strings a black and then you string a black on one of the strings and now you're just gonna tie it as tight as you can. And after the bottom. So it's again two beads. So you just take your string. And you're gonna string it through. This bead right here. One end through it. And so you have like this, and then you'll string the other one through here. So there should be one through one through this bead and one through that one. And you're gonna string and unite you know, your strings and then string on the black on both. And then string on a black on one string. And then tie it. 